Ah, oh boy, your body they what thing they happen? You they ooze. I'm a typical Yoruba, yeah. typical Ibile. When we say I get one papa, we say all those kind of things. Even a child, we say then they kill them. Really? <laughs> ah. Hello. Body. <laughs> ah, Jesus. Hello, girlfriend. All it, all it. I'm seriously tired of this relationship. What do you mean tired? Is he your tired? I said I'm tired. Why is it that every time we talk, your mouth is always oozing? You always make me feel like I'm under the anointing of mouth odor. Even your mouth is smelling on the phone. Why? What have I done? You said it's natural. It's natural. What is natural about that one? It's natural. Better, you know all those brush they normally use to wash car tires? Better go and buy and be brushing like 50 times a day. You even have body odor joint. You need perfume. You need Jesus in your life. What are you saying? Ah, leave me alone, Jerry. Oh, I almost even forgot my viewers, my sisters and brothers. What? Which is worse, body odor or mouth odor? And what is the solution? Please let me tell this girl. I love her, but it's painful. I don't know. Let me tell her. Which is worse, mouth odor or body odor? I say body odor, cause you can't hide it. You know if. If you're in public and you don't speak, nobody would know that you have like mouth odor or if you use like mint. But body odor, you can't contain it. Once you step out in public, you're on a bus, you're inside a confined area, everybody knows that you're around and stuff. So yeah, body odor is far worse than mouth odor. Mouth odor. Why? Because once you speak, everybody will smell it. So I think mouth odor is worse. Body. <laughs> You ask Why now? Why? Ah, uh, because the entirety of the person smells, and uh, it's a lot. It's a whole lot. I think um, body odor, um, body odor in the sense that um, with body odor, body odor is not controllable. When you're in public, everybody can you know feel it, can smell it. But with mouth uh, mouth odor, in as much as your mouth is not open well, you can still control it. Uh, body odor is the worstest disease that I know. Why? Because anywhere you are, they will get the, they will perceive the scent. Mm. But mouth odor, even though say, actually if you don't talk, when you just enter inside box, that you didn't talk to anybody. Even though say, if they greet you, you can use air to answer, because you don't want to let them to know your secret. Mm. But body odor, immediately you enter box like this, everybody will start perceiving the odor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is smelling? What is smelling? What is smelling? People will be coming down. Body odor. Why now? Well, I feel because it's easier to detect that a mouth odor. The mouth odor, if you don't have a conversation with the person, you might not easily detect, but just turning into the person, you can easily detect odor. So I think. You know, um, body odor can actually be controlled. It has ha he had so many antidotes that you can use to control, but the mouth odor is worse. I mean, it has caused a lot of couples to separate. I'm, I'm serious. <laughs> so is that worse? I believe mouth odor is worse. Why? <laughs> Because when you have mouth odor, it's very, very hard for you to communicate with anybody around you. Well, you can cope with body odor to me, but the mouth, man, that's something strong and serious. Why yeah. now? Why now? Yeah, because, you know, if you are beside me now, you have odor, and I'm like, okay, well, this is fine. But then you approach me, <sighs> hello. No, no, that's atomic bomb right there. Ah, <laughs> Jesus. That. No. So I prefer the body should smell than the mouth, but I don't think any of the two should smell. Well, I think body odor. Why? Uh, well, I know mouth odor to be, sometimes a number of times you can apply some um, household measures that can help you to, you know, manage it very, very well. But I really do not know of body odor. So I would say that mouth um body odor is a little bit you know on on the i don't know about it so it's not so good for me how will you tell your girlfriend she has mouth ah the same thing you say do you want to talk to <laughs> do you want to gum <laughs> yes. do you want to gum every time take all bits i bought all bits for you i love you <laughs> take yeah, a packet of like, i'm tired every time tom 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 say you can't be tired no you need <laughs> it and then the conversation will happen she says why why do i need it 
fact is, for some people, you owe them honesty. If it's like a sister, if it's my brother that is telling me, or my, I know that it's coming from a place of love, or my, my brother is telling me, or my mom, or my, I know that, ah, okay, it's true. I'll tell you, you have body odor. I'll tell you, you have body odor. Just like that. Just like that. Your boyfriend, you just say. My boyfriend cannot have body odor. My boyfriend cannot have body odor. Okay, but if the person is very close to you or an outsider. I'll tell the person calmly, not rudely. I'll tell the person you have body odor. That's all. Okay, if someone you know now have mouth odor, uncle. You have mouth odor. You just say, you have mouth odor. Ah, Jesus. You won't even care if the person will cry or. Uh, no, I'll, I'll, I'll tell her point blank. How? Ah. Imagine me as that your friend. Ah, oh boy, your body, they. I'm waiting to happen, you the ooze. <laughs> you the ooze. ooze now. <laughs> like you're oozing. Wow. Yeah. What if the person now starts crying? No, no, uh, uh, there's always a way around it, you know. You won't make the person feel really bad. Like, bro, you have body odor. I think you should always, you know, use um, a deodorant okay. so that... Mouth odor, uncle. Mouth odor, well, still the same way. At least there are many um, tooth, um paste out there that can control mouth odor. Yes, I would advise him to get the best one. I can just have just similar lie that what happened is that, you know, if someone has sleep, if he wake, you will have some odor at mouth. And then she said she can be aware or people have been telling her that ah, if you have mouth odor, you will have it in brain in sense that ah, this my boyfriend want to, you don't want to link the way to me directly. He's using an idea to just let me know that ah, I'm having mouth odor. Oh, body odor. I, don't, I think some people, that I'm just saying some people, but it might not be because they're not actually bathing or this thing, might be something else. So, I don't know how exactly I'll grab at that, but I just let her know that is it at the cream or is it not smelling nice or something like that? Then try and grab. Our friends probably to my tell her the same thing. That's actually something very obvious. So I think our friends, to our close friends, will be able to tell her that not just me. So if one or two people are already making slight comments about something like that, she also should be able to grab. I've done this several times. I just call the person to a private, maybe we are in a meeting or in a, in a, in a public place, and I say, please come, I want to tell you something. See, I, because I, you are my friend, I just want to tell you this. There's an order. Either go and buy a peppermint or a tom tom or something to reduce. Some of them appreciate me for it. But if it's someone that I'm not too sure of, I just draw away from the person. I don't want to come too close to that person. And that's too bad, really. Yeah. I will, I will try as much as possible not to hurt the person. You know, you know, in the sense that I'll tell her, maybe when we're on bed, you know, when, when I know she's happy, I won't tell her in a way, in a way, in a way of insult, you know, I will tell her coolly that, Charlie, you have this, you know. Charlie, your mouth, the ooze. So, do something about it. Girlfriend? Yes, now. Girlfriend. girlfriend. Yeah, the same thing with my girlfriend. I would, but I can't date somebody who has a mouth or the Never. I will tell him straight up. How? How? Imagine I'm the person. Yeah. Your mouth is smelling. Can I buy you gum or can I just give you something? Wow. Yes. You know, life is straight up things. You can't just hide that kind of thing from somebody. Okay. It's an outsider. <laughs> an outsider. I'll just mind my business and go. I don't know you. So, so close friend. my close friend is different. I'll tell you straight up. Okay. Your mouth is smelling. Did you spray today? What's going on? Stuff like that. <laughs> I'd have to be frank with the person and you know tell the person so that the person will not go about embarrassing himself. You know, the first um, solution to a problem is admitting the problem exists. So once the person knows, then we can probably go for a medical assistance so the person can work on himself. And probably, maybe it's just an hygiene issue. So the person will just work on himself and, you know, come out of it. <laughs> ah. Hello, buddy. <laughs> ah, Jesus. If you want to give you hundred million naira, hundred mil no ten million dollars, mouth odor or body odor, pick one. Ten million dollars. Mouth odor. Why? Why do you pick? Because I don't speak. I'll just be spending my money. <laughs> You just spending your money. Yes. So if you want to buy a car, 
and you are going by yourself. How you know? Mm -hmm. That's why there's a pen and a note. I'll write it. I can send someone that knows I have mouth odor already. I don't need to communicate to the masses. I'll send a person to get it. The person you are now dating call with the money. He will deal with it. Mouth. Why? Ah. I don't need to talk now. You won't. If I don't talk, you won't know I have a problem with me. But what you know, once I enter anywhere, everywhere stinks and they know there's... Okay, so boo, how will you guys be going? Who will know? There's money. So, Boo will deal with it. Just there's money. It will work around the mouth odor. I would rather be body odor. Why I said that is, you know, everybody can feel it. So I will not be the one to suffer it alone. Ah, <laughs> you want to put other people in your suffering? But at least I will get something at the end of the day, yeah? Ah. Mouth odor. I pick mouth odor. Why? Because that one is very is a minor case. Because body odor, if you walk, if you just step small like this, people go passive. You understand? If you enter box, people go passive. But well, actually, if you just keep we don't go kiss for my for house. So, or if you want to talk to me, we will go day long distance. We go day year. You understand? So if you day wear camera one day, we myself day year. You give me my mouth. Because <laughs> <Why? Why? Why? laughs> I can easily hide that. How will you the idea? You want to buy something? How will you go? You want to buy something? I don't need to speak directly to you. I can stay far and let my voice be loud or something like that. So you I want don't. to bend the neck, you know, babe. Now, how will you be doing about this? Now? When I say baby, is it sweet? And everywhere, <laughs> and the girl is sweating. If, if it's that, if it's that, then before doing that, I would just get chicken or something to for the bread. What if it's very con con we want to give you that uh, after five, five minutes it will be coming back. I ain't let more yeah. <laughs> Charlie I'll get the hundred million dollars and I will know how to manage the How are you going to manage you know, it's the personal thing I'll manage it. We go give Everybody wants to come close to a rich person. So if I have hundred million dollars and you don't want to come close to me because of my mouth or though then it's a problem. Mouth. <laughs> Why now? But you just said, I don't like mouth odor. Ah. Yes, uh -huh, but now you're talking about me. Mm. So I can keep quiet. I can shut my mouth up. Take, and I'll take that money and I'll go. But, you know, the body, once I just come close to you, you know, you're already smelling. But my mouth, I can still hide it. So if you now want to kiss and cover, mm. what will you be doing? Will you be using money to cover your mouth? Well, kissing is not compulsory every time. So you can either make excuses or... Um, Come clean with your partner. Yeah. Uh, babe, there's money. But my mouth smells, so are you down for that? <laughs> okay. I'm not sure, so why not? Then we're good to go. Okay, so what do you think are the solutions to mouth odor? to mouth odor, I think visit the dentist, treat yourself, then for body, be clean, hygiene. Well, yeah, for some people, you know, their natural smell isn't that good. So it's about taking care of yourself. It's personal hygiene. You know, wash your clothes regularly. Change your underwear. If you sweat a lot, shave. Use deodorant. Deodorant is not expensive. Take a bath. You understand? Wear clean clothes. If you don't have money for perfume, there's body spray. There's body spray of 800, 500. Uh, what's it called? Deodorant. And you would, you'll be alright, really. So it's just personal hygiene that I would say is a problem for a lot of people. You have to take proper care of yourself. For somebody that has body odor, at least the person should know that if every other person is having a bath just once a day, she should at least try to do maybe like four, three times a day. Then you use cologne, good body spray, roll on and everything and be tidy. The mouth odor is a bit technical, but it's, it's, you can treat it. Now we have dentists. If you, if you go to meet a dentist, dentists have, they have some solutions for mouth odors. They have some chemicals that they use to take care of the mouth. These things have some. If, if you ask some, the natural person, they will say, I can't afford, I can't afford. But then there are certain things when you know it's important to you, you go all the way to do it. The only way to manage it is to have constant um, bait, then, you know, use deodorant. It's as good as that. Almost everybody have body odor. Do you get When you sweat, you know, uh, body odor erupts. So you use um, deodorant. That's the best way. The mouth odor. Then you shave your armpit as well. The mouth odor, the same thing, you know, brush regularly, maybe twice a day. And use a very good toothpaste. But for me, oh, me, oh, I'm a typical Yoruba, yeah. typical Ibile. When we say, I get one papa, we say all those kind of things. Even HIV, we say, then they carry on. Really? Sincerely. You understand? 
Have you seen anybody with the Ankoye cure? Yes, yes. All this body odor is a minor tree tree, is a minor case. To cure it, mouth odor body odor is a minor case. Sharp, sharp. They will kill it. They will... Even though they will just use it to bats to for three to four days or seven days. Wow. You go, go. You know, go even passive in the kind of thing again. Wow. You, are, you want your brush, you brush your brush your tongue well and stuff. And even when you're in public, I do it a lot. When after a while, I try to smell my breath and see if I'm if I'm okay. Yes, you get it. So if I'm okay. If I'm not, I'll go and buy Vicks Blue Tom Tom and just lick and. Well, I think Papa. I drained and using the right deodorants and stuff like that. Okay, Mouth of you brush well and location are using the chewing gum stuff, the metal stuff. You know, but four times daily. If you like swimming, swim a lot. Uh, spray, you know, those important areas. Um, try to sweat less. <laughs> I'm being like, Places that will make you sweat, you know, try to avoid it. You can't really avoid that, but just try. Maybe use Uber or phone or something. <laughs> there's no money in car, you have to enter a car. Like, bike. <laughs> Where breeze is always blowing you. Yeah, stuff like that, I guess. Mouth or don't want Well, mouth is very serious, you know. Now on is a very serious thing. You know, some people brush four times, but, man, I don't know. I think it's the tongue. So once they can really get to scrub their tongues properly, then... Yeah, they should be good. I know mouth odor to be easily controlled. You know, when you brush in the morning, you brush in the evening, you apply salt and water, you know, mouthwash, you apply some other mouthwash. Oh, salt and water. You know, you put salt in um, a little bit of warm water, then you gargle. Hello, dear friend. Ah, your mouth is still smelling on the phone. I just have to talk to you. I hope you have learned from what people said in the video. Uh, 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 uh. If you like, don't learn. Uh, come to my house and let your mouth and body be smelling as if somebody is inside the mortuary. Uh, before, I'll dump you for DJ Copy. You know she has been begging me for over 20 years. Okay, that's my girl. You need to change her. Oh. Ah, my sister's and brothers. Mouth odor and body odor. Uh, which is worse? Oh, you have you heard what people have to say. Mouth odor. When you uh, it's be like they are under the anointing of mouth odor. Phew, saliva and everything. <laughs> For more videos like this, follow us on all social media platforms you can think about. I still remain F L U O R I N, Florine YP, your mother's favorite future son in law. That was fast. For more videos like this, follow us. They call me Florine YP. Thanks for choosing Battlebox. Oh, Digba. <laughs>